Ooh, it's your boy Ryan the Dreamer, and welcome to another part of Let's Play The Sims 4 Bachelor Challenge. Welcome to my channel, number one. Subscribe to me, I am poor, number two, but also number one. Uh, it is the day after eliminations, and we sent Tatiana home. We kicked her fake trifling self out. She's dusty, she's crusty, and she is rusty. And we told her that she needed to GTFO, and that's exactly what she did. So she's out there, you know, groveling on the streets for whatever reason. And uh, we're, we're here today. We have a house party plan to start later tonight. You see right now that Paolo is playing foosball with Claire. He wanted to... Ooh! Well, now he wants to woohoo with Holden. Can't let that come true, but it's nice to know that Holden's someone that he's thinking about. I was saying words and I completely forget what they were. We have a house party today, later tonight, at 8. And so we're going to probably just kind of do like a little montage of random clips of things that happened before then. But we'll do the main part of this part at 8 o'clock when the party starts, so I'm very excited about that. Everything is with Holden. He's really fixated on Holden today. I don't... <gasps> Maybe that's why. They both have tattoos. They're both bros, you know. They have longish hair for guys. Both dark hair, even though they're different colors, you know. I don't know. It looks like a match made in heaven to me. I've been thinking maybe opposites attract. This might be crazy, but let's go have lunch at the glass and see if things get spicy. Has Vlad not looked at himself in the mirror? He, oh, Claire, girl, I'm sorry that you're being harassed like this by that monster. Ugh, that is absolutely disgusting. I don't know why he is so fixated on Holden today. I don't know what's going on on this day, but he's feeling it. He wants to flirt with the man. We, we're gonna let it happen. This is what he wants to do. I just don't understand. I thought... If it was up to me, I would have him do Ken, because I think he really does like Ken. Kiss someone. Okay. We spent a lot of time with Holden. I don't want to get too crazy there. He does want to kiss someone, so we'll find someone else that, that we can um, kind of do some stuff with. Ken is someone that he really, really, as we tell from yesterday's eliminations, he was about to just throw all, you know, cares and everything aside, and he was just about to freaking go for it, no matter what happened. So we're gonna, you know, love him up just a little bit. Nah, Claire, this is not for you. I don't know why you decided to come in here. Ugh. But, oh, oh, I see what I'm saying? Ask someone to go say me, not yet. Oh my gosh. See, the game's on my side. He and Ken, they just, they really, they're really out here having some kind of connection. Let's see what else we can do. Flirt with Holden. Enough flirting with Holden. He's not the romantic. One thing I forgot to do is this important part of the ceremony. I'm so excited about kicking Tatiana out. Oh my gosh, I can't get it to focus right. You know what, it's fine. I was so excited about kicking Tatiana out that I completely forgot to do this to her. To, to, to her. Wow, she's gone. And she was the centerpiece too. And I believe this was the picture I used as, as an example in the first part when I explained how we were gonna use these pictures. I think I used her first. That's called foreshadowing and also accidents because I didn't see her going home first at all. I thought Princeton was gonna eat it. Okay, so he wants to do something romantic. Let's just, let's embrace her. Embracing is a really simple thing to do. Everyone's about to die in this house. I need to install a thermostat. Stat. Oh my gosh. She sounded like she needed that. See, look at this. This is nonsense what Ken's wearing. He knows exactly what he's doing. Emily, girl, what's this hair? <laughs> she just lost all of her fabulousness in two seconds. Honestly, front runners for favorites for me are Ken and Claire. I hope they can get their acts together. I would love for it to come down between those two. I feel like it would be a really hard decision, but we'll see. We'll see. He decided to sit down and show Violet some kind of attention. You know, Violet, I've always pictured her as a really confident, kind of go after what she wants girl, but she isn't, she hasn't really been doing anything noteworthy, you know? Holden wants to woohoo with Paolo, Claire wants to woohoo with Paolo, Ken wants to make out with Paolo, I just, Paolo was really that guy, like, this is really a fight to the death. Ken, that was pitiful, I expect more of you, and you know this. I'm getting tired of seeing Holden's face. Oh my gosh. What is it with Holden? I don't know. He must be some kind of a witch and put some kind of a spell on him. Emily made this deck on burnt popcorn and everyone keeps eating it as if it's good. I don't understand it. I don't get it. It's not anything that we should make a habit out of. Oh, we don't have anything for you to do, boo. Oh, 
I lied. We have a whole piano here for you. Oh, she's going to sing for us? Oh, gosh. She's telling jokes. She's a comedian. Girl, go home. But let's come here and let's dance and see who else joins us in. Joins us in with the... With, uh, wow. In, okay. <laughs> let's see who else joins us on the dance floor. Okay, Violet did. That's really good for Violet. I see Ken and Emily is over there dancing as well. That's really nice and fun. Like Princeton's about to come over here and join us too. Yes, he is. One thing I'll say about these two, they're really up underneath each other. Like Holden and Violet, I know that they know each other before they came here. Holden will go different places. You know, Violet will sometimes go talk to other people. But these two, they're always talking to each other. It's almost like you can't really learn one unless you get rid of the other. Which is quite an interesting situation when it comes to eliminations in the next few parts. So, I don't know. That's something that we'll be thinking about. Because we really like Finn Quinn. What's his name? Ken. <laughs> but we don't really know much about Emily, and I think that that's sad. We need to communicate with our guests, so let's come over here and talk to Emily. Like that might be a fun thing that we can do. Let's brighten her day. Yeah. Okay, good. Let's ask about his day. Oh lord, he's likely to just climb Holden like a tree. Let's um give Ken a heartfelt compliment. Let's try to talk to everyone at least once if they're down here. I'm not gonna chase after anyone in a house where everyone's supposed to be chasing after me. Let's go ahead and get Claire over here. We're going to ask the swing with. That's adorable. Let's have a deep conversation with Claire. She's someone that's worth having a deep conversation with, I feel like. Claire is definitely someone that wants kids. I think Paola definitely wants kids, too. And Claire, like, wants kids 100% for sure. I know she's down. She's ready. She probably already has a nursery decorated and everything, too. And let's brighten uh, Princeton's day as well. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, we got gold. Ken stays flirty. He literally is always flirty. Kiss someone. <gasps> Who does want to be his first kiss to be? Ooh! Well, you know, it doesn't even have to be a first kiss. It can just be like a kiss on the hands or something. Now, I do kind of want to get out of the three that I've, you know, declared as my favorites. Let's try to get someone else. Because, you know, if it was up to me, it'd be Ken, it'd be Claire. Apparently, he wants to be Holden. I don't know. He just wants to chat with Holden, so that's fine. Let's, um... Let's give Violet a chance. Let's add Violet to our little group. Let's come over in this room. We're just going to chat with her for a little bit. Just see how she's feeling. See what's going on. Be a little bit proactive in this process, I guess. If that comedian does not go home, no one likes her. No one's giving her the time of day. She's bad. Oh, let's get all this food in here. Pause. We, we, this is going to feed the masses. This is some five loaves, two fish kind of stuff. Well, I'm going to wrap this part up here. The party ended. We got gold. So that was really, really exciting. Um, next part, we have solo dates. And so the three people that we did not take out on dates, the first go around, we'll take out tomorrow. And that'll be exciting to get to know some of the people who haven't had that much of a chance to get around. And um, it'll be a really, really fun time. So until then, leave some comments. Let's discuss what went down like the video, subscribe to me, I need it. I want all of you to go and be great, okay? Keep it sleazy.